street Will you the poor boys I play it Bring a nickel, tap your feet This is an easy ukulele tutorial Let's go over the chords and then I'll show you some of the strumming issues that I'll help you work out You need a C and a C looks like this and if it doesn't sound beautiful like that it's a tuning issue and I have a link up here and then down below in the description box my double tuning system that gets rid of any of the problems that you may have as an adult beginner ukulele player trying to figure out how to tune your instrument. There's also a G and there's more than one way to play a G. I play it with my piece fingers on the C and A string, a second fret, and then this finger is here on E string on the third fret. If it does not sound like this, a couple things. It just may be that this is not the best fingering for you. Other things to look for is are you muting notes unintentionally? What do I mean? For example, my ring finger is playing the E string here, and if it's falling down, over the top of the A string, you'll get that kind of sound. It's very important with your fingers that you learn how to depress the strings very clearly with just the tips. So getting these fingers up here on the tippy tips, this finger too. You probably can't see it, but there is a lot of space in here as I'm arching over. So be thinking of this shape when you're making your chords in order to make them sound nice and beautiful. Same thing with the F. Most likely it's this middle finger again reaching over to the G string. It's falling down. But that's, this is how you're properly doing an F chord and make it sound beautiful. Test it with your thumb with each string ringing out nicely. It would be really helpful if you grab the chord chart for this song. And I have access to all my chord charts through Patreon and you help support this free channel. And you can do it at $3 a month. You get access to all my chord charts. Plus I do two live Zoom sessions a month for people to ask questions, jam with me, get all sorts of feedback on their playing. So yeah, come join us. I color coded the chord chart for this one because some chords get four beats and some chords get two. When we look at the chorus, it's nice and easy. Everything gets two down strums per chord. So let's work through that together. Get your ukulele, let's do it really slowly. No pesky lyrics, just the chords. One, two, here we go. F, two, C. not working for you, just sit back, get your favorite beverage, and just relax playing those chords, working it out so that you kind of get a muscle memory thing going because music is a multitasking event and you're trying to put so much together and you know what, scientists have shown that even people who think they're wonderful multitaskers, well they're not. And so, but you have to be to be a musician and so getting some things on autopilot, so just I think chords, getting those chord changes, just F, C, just getting those down nice and easy so it happens automatically. That will serve you well. In the verses is where we have some chords getting four and some chords getting two beats. And so I've color coded the two beat chords. It looks like this. Notice this, the GC that happens at the end of those lines and then the third line, everything's four. Let's give it a try together. One, two, ready, begin. C.
and join me in a play along. Here's my recommendation if you're a beginner and you really like this song, is play along with me 10, 20 days in a row. You will find that if you just start with the chorus fitting in the words, oh, there's my dog again, <laughs> fitting in the chorus with the words, maybe just a little out in the street, just getting that much in. Do it every day you'll find that you'll start getting more comfortable, you'll get more words fit in. Don't expect to be able to do the whole thing all at once unless you have prior music experience. That's my teacherly advice. Let's play along with... <coughs> okay, excuse me, I had to cough that one out. And let's see if I can get through this without coughing. One, two, here we go. this song which is in a kind of a challenging range for me all the more difficult but you know what it doesn't stop me it shouldn't stop you on your ukulele journey um, get a ukulele shirt and join your friends out on the street somebody will have their day brightened because of it